p.m. and I really want to make some tomato soup because my pregnant sister has requested it so of course I'm going to try to make it for her. We're doing something extremely exciting right now. Guess what the heck we're gonna find out. We are gonna find out if the baby is a girl or a boy. <laughs> I have a huge, huge feeling that it's a girl. I don't know why, even my sister, she like dreams about a girl. So I'm like, girl, it's a girl. But imagine if it's a boy and then we're just like all shocked that it's a boy. And if so, then that's the cheekiest baby we ever knew. I'm going over at Alice and Dan's house right now because I asked them to do it with me separately because they're going to reveal it to the rest of the family tonight at dinner and we're going out for dinner. And I was like, there's no way I can react appropriately in public. So I need to find out in private. So we're going to head there literally now. I should leave, but... Tell me where the baby is right now. What's it gonna be, huh? Um, hello, baby. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> so, what do I eat one? Yeah, that's gonna reveal it. Where's my phone? Okay. <laughs> you wanna know now? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, am I gonna be shocked? You have to get a real big bite though. Where, where should it's I? It's like a line, like pretty much there. You can break it in half or take a big bite. So, what's your guess? It's a girl. Okay. No, I'm scared! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. Show us, show us, show us! <laughs> we knew it, everyone! We did it. We knew it, just stop. <laughs> I know. My like three dreams are <laughs> For each family member, we're gonna bring it to dinner. And then everyone has to do it the same time. <laughs> this is crazy. Sizzling. Guys, this is my favorite kinche chige that I tried to replicate last week, but I can't. What do you think it is? It's a girl? <laughs> a girl! <laughs> Are you excited? Mum's wearing pink for the baby girl. <laughs> Thank you, Dad. <laughs> so I was right. But well, I wasn't right. It took me 40 minutes to get there. But. <laughs>
much Duna. I'm only up to like episode three and I actually am very impressed. I was in my pajamas all day yesterday. I did not do anything except for go to dinner with Butter's family and it was really nice. We had some kebabs and delicious. And then we played game night. I think I came back home around 3 a.m. <laughs> Because we were playing games all night, it was really fun. Just getting ready for the day, I think I'm gonna go to Ikea. So busy. I want a new desk set up, and I was gonna get like one of these ones that go up, but I found this mini one for 129 so you can like raise it up. And I kind of love that it's portable because I'm on my laptop editing all the time. So if I could bring this into the kitchen or in my bedroom, do you know how amazing that is? I got a pegboard situation, I bought two. They're two big ones. Apparently I'm redoing my office. Something we didn't know before we came here, but we are. And I got all the new like containers that go with the pegboard. It's so cool. I'm excited to actually organize my office now. I'm devastated. The laptop stand, that white one, like the mini one, it's not in stock and it's not in stock online as well. It must be really popular. Online says it'll be back in like November, so I'm willing to wait, honestly. We're back from Ikea. I'm gonna have to deal with the stuff tomorrow because right now I actually have to get ready for a dinner. I'm dinner out this week. I had family dinner on Friday. I had my second family dinner with Atta's family yesterday. And now I have my third family dinner <laughs> with my friends today. I'm not complaining, but it's a lot. I normally don't really double book, so. Guys, can you tell that I um, trimmed my hair yesterday? I feel like whenever my hair gets too long, it gets really heavy because I've got really dense hair and so it loses a lot of volume. And yesterday I literally just roughly trimmed the roughest layers, but I swear it makes the biggest difference because now I've got a bit more shape and it's just easy to chuck around like this. So. All right, let's go. I think I'm potentially running late. I'm not gonna lie, where's my car keys? <laughs> We'll see. I'm winning this. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I am. <laughs> I win. All right. Good job. I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna underdog. Beat underdog. I told you. Are you gonna beat it? I'm gonna beat it, and I'm gonna win. Hey. Yeah! Have I beat. I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna beat it. Did you see my shirt? Okay. Thank you, nice. Hey, Jay. Hey,
I just left. I want to build this. This is the coffee table that like was a double set. If you know me, you know I love a good IKEA build. It's like an egg shape. There's this big one. And then there's a smaller version and they kind of just layer on top of each other. I officially moved into this house in March, so it's been about seven months, I want to say. And I really just gave up on like anything to do with interior. But yeah, partly just because I'm a minimalist and I just don't want to accumulate things, a lot of things yet. Like I feel like that's something I will do once I know I'm in my kind of more longer term home. Um, and I think that's going to happen like when me and Atta decide to get a house together. But for now, I really, I don't need a lot. Um, but I definitely needed a coffee table. And I'm, I'm sure there's a lot I can do to make this place feel homier. This is what it's looking like, except I don't like that it's higher than my couch because my couch is a low rise. One thing about me is I love low rise furniture, but when you go down here, can you see it's like so much higher? So I kind of have a crazy idea right now and I think I'm going to cut the legs off <laughs> just a bit, just so that it's level with my couch and then I'll be happy because I have the tools to do it. Like my dad's tools that we use for the floorboards, and you guys know, I know how to handle tools. So I think I'm about to do it, I'm not kidding. I'm Okay, so I've done the big one, and I've made the big one the same size as the little one. I love that so much more. So now I've got to cut this one because I want it to be able to go under. So this one's going to be extra low, but I really did that. <laughs> so okay, this is the end result. It's the most subtle difference, but I can tell so much. If anything, I could probably have cut it even shorter, but I'm going to leave it as is.